Hello everybody, and welcome back to some more Enigmatica 2. Why yes, that is a new skin I'm wearing. <laughs> uh, I thought it was time to update my skin, so here we have it. It is uh, proof of me, um, my beard getting a little bit bigger, and uh, yeah, periphery t-shirt, different jeans, all good. You can probably see that in the side of my head, that is the, um, the what's to call it, the benevolent goddess charm. Actually, if I turn off, I can find where it is. My hat, give myself a haircut. You can't quite see it. But you can see it in inventory, can't you? There we are. It's on the side there. Uh, I learned this thing with baubles, actually. You can. This thing hides them. There we are. So we can hide the sword journal sash as well. And. You know what? I don't even know where the rings go. Don't know where they go. Anyway. Um, enough about me. Today we are going to uh, do a few things, including the uh, change of aesthetics. I think that's why I started off with the skin change. It doesn't look that great in here. Um, it could use a bit of bit of stuff to fill up the gaps. <laughs> um, and there's some things over here that need a little bit of tidying up. So I've had to put in um, some more of these biofuel generators. Um, we ran out of wood. We went out of wood because we didn't have enough power going in. So this all needs to be tidied up downstairs. Uh, some of these machines probably need to go upstairs in our little machine room. Uh, hence why it's called that. Um, again, some more gaps here. That can be probably hidden. Uh, might put another farming station. Spread this out a little bit. But yeah, that might change out the Ender Lilies and the Never Walk because we've got massive stacks amount of them. <laughs> but I don't really need them. Um, the wart's good for the biofuel, so we probably keep that. And uh, the ender pearls, I mean, I could start storing them somewhere. Upstairs. This will, again, this needs to be tidied up a little bit. This will make room for an ME system. Not today, but uh, at some point. Probably put some stuff along here. I don't actually have much of this wood. <laughs> They're just sort of placeholders. So maybe I should put different woods in that farm so at least we're starting to get a bit of a uh, bit of a backlog on them maybe not sure there's loads of metals in our chest that need to be put into here just so they don't take up all the storage and i'm thinking about moving this downstairs somewhere but we'll get to that a little bit later uh, one thing we did do between episodes was uh, actually let's have a look and see how this is getting on <laughs> oh we're almost at 100 we're going to need that so we can um Put some stuff on our oh, actually put this our armor back on because uh, things things making noises. Aha! Get all these things down here. Uh, I've been turning that on and off, and we'll probably put that on a timer at some point. But for now, I just sort of leave it going. We've got a backlog of foods, and there's one for cake underneath. Uh, but this is how it looks in here now. I like how the Kiki Maris floated ones with. Take up the same spot as the, uh, the sparks, so it looks like the flowers themselves are feeding this middle one here. Pretty cool. Uh, we added this actually, and that's because we had a spare spot in not in here. That's for the bone mill. Uh, we had a spare spot in this one, and I'm making veggie bait. Seems we're getting string from our system and loads of carrots from this. Thought we'd uh, make some bait, so that goes outside here. Uh, I put a torch on it because I'm not too sure if snow stops things getting caught or not. But that is getting us some free food. Free food. Um, not too much, but it's going to be enough to keep us going. I mean, we've got food in here. And we've got loads of books, actually. Should probably have a look into forestry at some point as well. Night vision, infinity. There's a lot of good stuff in here. Um, Acre infinity? Auto smell, understand. Airtight seal will need. Uh, loads of. Ooh, silk touch. I'm put that on the elementary restored, I reckon. War. Is that another one? I'm holding. Insight. Insight was. Gets you more experience when using it. So, again, I could put that on the pick. Um, maybe on the sword. Get more XP. Infinity. Power of Vorpal. Soulbound. Soulbound isn't. I don't think it works in this mod. 
Uh, might just not work with Britannia stuff, but I'll go have a check of that. I can have a check in a little bit. I uh, had a bit of a brain fart then. <laughs> um, I was looking at the, um, the uses for an egg. Of course, there's a few things like obviously the cake, uh, some filters and a few machines, mainly food, but I caught this at the very end. Where are you? Should have gone backwards. The golden egg from open blocks. I think... I think this is something we want. Um, I know it explodes. <laughs> but I'm not too sure on the radius. So, uh... Should we do it outside and be cautious? I think we probably should. Golden egg. Open blocks. Right, let's use this. <laughs> let's utilise this. Um, where should we go? Let's just go into our little mountain -y bit here. Um, I started doing a bit of decoration, so we've got a stream here. It keeps freezing up, even though I've got um, lanterns underneath. Uh, but that just goes down to the bottom there. It doesn't have a source, but I might sort of make it go up here into a pond, a pondy thing. So actually, yeah, if we're going to have a pondy thing, let's uh, pop this here, shall we? How do we use it like this? Oh, here we are. Here we go. There we go. Take your time. <laughs> is, it gonna, is it doing it? It is doing it. It's just taking its time. Does it float? I thought it floated. Oh. Here we go. That's like, oh God, there's a piece of grass. There's bits of snow and turf blocks. Oh yeah, I'm glad we didn't do this inside our base now. That is proper weird, doesn't it? <laughs> the suspense is killing me. Come on. Even that llama's watching. Come on. It's got him really bright. Boom. Hello, mate! <laughs> Mini me! Oh, look how cute you look! <laughs> oh, and do if we. Is it like a parrot? Can we. You jump on our shoulders? No. Check us out. Oh yeah, look at me. I've got cool armor on. You haven't. <laughs> um, I don't think they do anything. Do they, do they follow? Follow, follow me, mini me, mini mini me. We'll make you follow us. Uh, we need a name for him. I think <laughs> little Richie, maybe. Don't know. Um, the first thing I need to do uh, is improve ourselves just that little bit. Now, I've been saying it for a while now, uh, but really need to get flight. So we want to check out uh, angle rings. <laughs> um, and it's a bit of a process to it. Um, we need to catch a ghast and a bat. We need to make a ring of the flying squid, whatever that means. Uh, chicken ring. And all this stuff, right? Um, so we do it in stages. So the chicken ring is just some of this stuff. We've got feathers downstairs, which is pretty good. Any more feathers in here? Probably. There we go. And what's everything? Forgot already. Um, I made, oh, you made them beforehand. These lassos. We're going to need one for each step. And uh, oh, yes, yeah, Swarf gave me the drop of evil already. Because uh, Smolf's a cool guy. Uh, is it this red... No, it's a red sonating phenomenon. Let's take a few of them just in case. Now we need to... Make the chicken one first. So... Iron. Iron and a chicken. Uh, is that all the iron we've got? <laughs> uh, I keep... Um, what's it called? We're topping up the... Um, what am I doing? Keep topping up the um, the blaze maker thing downstairs, and that takes um, a lot of space. So, can we, make, can we make the inventory smaller on that? Don't really know. Is Mini Me still up here? Oh, this is what we wanted. Check on! My boy, here he is. Uh, we're just going to bring you inside because we don't want you running around at night. <laughs> It's fairly safe downstairs. 
Now, I think the little guys can be quite troublesome, if I remember correctly. Uh, I want to say they open up chests and stuff and knock out torches. So, you look at him. He's inquisitive already. Come on. Who you want? Have a look around. Check out the Britannia stuff. Nice. Um, was it like this? Chicken flight. Now this is a bubble and it uses grid power, but fortunately, fortunately, oh, we got that back. Oh, great. I'm glad I made loads of them. Um, fortunately, we're making grid power and we have been making grid power since uh, really early on with these water mills. So as you can see, we're generating 38 in total. Uh, and I'm using one of 38. And what is it? It's working already, isn't it? So I think, because we got in our, in our inventory. Nope, we just fall. Uh, Band of Mana, Band of Aura. Sorry, Band of Aura. All right, we hold shift. Okay, we can't. <laughs> Can't switch while it's holding shift. So F5, F5 again. Hold shift. Nope, hold space, wasn't it? You sort of glide down majestically like a chicken. Oh, and it's run out. Ah, oh, there's a bit of a bar there. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Ah! <laughs> cool. Well, that's one stage done. Next stage is. Need to make the ring of the flying squid. So that's with die, the chicken ring, and another lasso with a squid in it. Do we have a squid in that river thing? This way. That way? This way. You know what? Let's make it daytime just to make this thing a little bit easier. Um, I still need a bedroom. This is how we rock at the moment. Sun? Come on. German. I'm sure Gran and Small forgot a way of like, and Rascal in fact, got a way of sleeping really easily. Like really quickly. Is it a sleeping bag? Or is it some kind of charm? Not too sure. Do you, do you mind? <laughs> so, maybe me put you back in the lasso. Right, squid. Will there be a squid in this frozen ocean? Probably not. Will there be... Will there be? Will there be... Ocean, so that way. I mean, this is quite a f nice way of travelling, but it's uh, it does run out of power eventually. I mean, fortunately, we can do like backslash home, and it'll get us back home anyway. Squids, ha ha! Come back, are you? Come. I can't swim. I cannot swim. Oh, the current's too strong for me. Yes. Ah, uh, like a so. Oh, a polar bear. I didn't know we had one of these near us. Very fun. Very fun. Right, so next stage was with... Die, diamonds, and a pearl. Um... Let's just get a pearl from outside, shall we? And we will get around to tying this up in a little bit. Ah, <laughs> oh, this tree grew and trapped me. Am I in the tree? Why can't I... Why can't I punch? Uh, hello? Help me. <laughs> um, so we made some dye. And we can put it in our little drawers here. Just from the black for for all power power powder even even all one of these one of these uh, diamonds is what we're missing boop boop so does the flying squid ring make us swim faster is this right this isn't right at all is it boop yeah it is there's um. Where's our chicken wing? I, I imagine, yeah, I may, imagine it makes us swim faster. There we go. And it uses up that. 
Um, should we try it? We well, might as well. Put it on. Oh. <laughs> oh, I see. We just hold shift and we just... We fly like a squid. Yeah. Is that... Is that what's going on here? It is the ring of the flying squid, so... We can fly like a, like a squid does? Don't know. Right. Last stage. And it's going to take a little bit because I need to get a bat and a last, uh, ghast. So, first thing we can make is... The cursed lasso. I don't know why we need both. And they won't stack. And I need to go find a bat and a ghast. So, off to the nether for one. Oh, Richie. <laughs> you little troublemaker. Be gone. I see you. Come back here. You've been knocking off torches everywhere. I'm going to have to put some uh, some blazy things down as well. Because we don't want things spawning down there. Because that would be, be horrendous, wouldn't it? Uh, right, I'm going to tidy that up in a little bit. Go find a bat, get a ghast, and be back in a second. hiding <laughs> where's he hiding he's uh, temporarily trapped down here until I build some stairs which I'm gonna do in a little bit but I just want to uh, there you are hide in the corner oh what I can't rename him wait so if I if I rename him hold on hold on hold on <laughs> They're not in there. Where are they? They're in a in our loud main system. Where is it? Can we rename. I thought we could um, rename in something fun and different. Where are they? They're in there. Um, which I guess if we do my name, why did I not type? Hello? There's nothing in there. I've done this before. <laughs> I haven't got any. I haven't got any levels. Don't worry, we've got loads. 124. Is that enough? Is that enough for it? Captain Ricky. I guess we can like, um, in that case, rename it to any skin we want, which is pretty cool. We gone, Ricky. Get up here, are you? There we are. Well, we were gonna call him Ricky, but I guess no more. <laughs> um, we got the ghast, as I showed you in that last clip, and here we are, ready to go. Boom! Ah, oh, we kept these, of course we did. Excellent. So I think we can put these here, and now we got wings. Now we got wings, and we got creative flight, and it's just got quite fast actually. Quite fast. We're trapped inside, so let's uh, get out for a second. Ah, creative flight. So we can fly around our building and check it out. Uh, so as you can see, I've done a little bit of uh, foliage decoration. <laughs> just uh, putting some spruce leaves around the place. Just to, I guess, spruce it up, for a want of a better word. Um, 
there will be a bit more decoration going on uh, around the area. So I'm probably going to put loads of uh, spruce trees in this gap here. Potentially, maybe. Not sure yet. I'm going to have to get rid of that torch because I don't like it being there. But it keeps the snow away from our animal traps. Anyway. Uh, we've knocked this back a bit. The, uh, the farming stations. Just so we've got this pathway around the side. So we've got kind of like a, what's it called? A veranda. Is that what they're called? Like a little balcony thing. Goes way around the side. Um, it might come off to somewhere, but you know our base is quite big as it is anyway. Uh, yeah, so knock this back a little bit, put a third one in, and now we've got uh, the warts, the pearls, and the taters. And we've got a worm and some poisonous tatties that uh, can go somewhere at some point. Uh, like I say, a little bit tidier. Um, and I did build up this structure here. Um, this is above cloud level here. Just, by, I think, like by one block or so. Uh, and the space in the middle. We haven't got any plans for us yet. Um, there's probably space for two floors in here. Like another floor along there. Uh, but as I haven't got any plans for it yet, I'm just going to leave it blank. In fact, I might bring it in one block, just so the circle is just that one bit smaller. So I do have plans for this top bit, which is just above cloud level. Um, and that'll be botanical based. <laughs> I want to fight the Gaia Guardian, and uh, once I've done all my protection and stuff, I think we'll be ready. We won't do it in this episode, but um, now we've got flight. We can do a bit more building, which is what I'm going to do to finish off today. So I ended up knocking in a block, and we kind of staggered the, the living wood support, shall we call them? Um, there are a couple places, you can see under that snow, that... Um, Things can spawn on, but I think on this side we'll probably put a window in, you know, similar to that one. And it's the same on the other side. Uh, we extended this a little bit over here, just so we've got a bit more space on here. Not Again, not too sure what I'm going to use this bit for, or this entire floor for that fact. <laughs> it's weird looking up through the clouds, because you can't, you know, I mean, you can see the stars just about, but you can't really see the top of the build. Uh, it could be my settings. Don't really know. Um, so we've got a potential floor here, which, I mean, if you're in the clouds, doesn't really... Be like looming right over your head. <laughs> so I have to see how that gets on. And yeah, one just at the top here. Uh, that'll probably be ceiling, and then I might start putting like a grass lay on the top here. Because um for my sort of uh Gaia garden fighting area, <laughs> I want it to be you know loads of loads of natural stuff. So it'll probably be grass, which we can get now um with our elementum shovel, because I put silk touch on it. Uh likewise I put silk touch and sharpness on the axe, I put Decay, sharpness, and stupid edge on the sword, on the ender, and flame and withering on the bow. Um, which is quite neat. Is there anything we can kill? Are you guys? Oh, they dodged. Hit withering. So with the flame and the withering, they're just going to die if we just one-shot them, essentially. Because they don't die anyway. Oh, there we are. I got head withering. <laughs> um, unfortunately, though, we've um, we used up all our levels. We had over a hundred, I think it was, and uh, we used it all up. So we haven't actually done anything on our on our, our army yet, uh, except for the dark boots. Actually, we put inventory two on there, so now I've got it filled up with some food, some torches, and our handy rods. Uh, there is space for one more thing, but I don't know what to put on there. And it's just coming along. This is getting there, but we're going to need... Uh, that was protection. Protection was... Yeah, like 28 levels per... Um, per protection four. And I'm sure there's other stuff we can put on as well, like aqua affinity, respiration, and all that stuff. So we're going to have to leave that for a while, and we'll, and we'll get stronger um, as and when. There are a few things that we can do, though, in the meantime. And I think one of them we can just do this. Uh, so our band of mana, is that what it is? I think we can upgrade it to the terror steel version. Just like that. Just like that. So it just has more more mana on it. So this, um, are you set to that? Probably not. Uh, I think so. It, I think it doubles the amount of uh, mana it can have, right? So it could be a full mana pool's worth. 
not sure. Like I say, we've got the uh, the mirror anyway, which is always topped up by a system downstairs. I think it's just if we just need a little bit extra because we've got um, the angel ring in the place of where the band of aura was, and that was sort of generating it passively. So much is there? Oh, yeah, there's none at all. That's going to have loads of mana. We're going to leave you in there for a little bit. Uh, where is the lexicon battalion? Because there are a few more things that we can do. Um, can we upgrade our sash? We can probably upgrade it if I spell it correctly. Let's go item. No, no, we want everything. Everything, please. Okay, so we got the sword journey sash. The plane side of the sash uh, is an alternative. Um, I like the aforementioned one. They're not going to wear a speed boost by default. However, they walk, they'll get fast. Uh, is that the thing? Sales with the wearer. Right, so with that, you sort of a map um you pick up speed over time but we were interested in this globe cutters one um this is it using gaia spirits and some elven resources uh so it makes it makes it faster so we're probably gonna get that but we need a guy spirit so we can't do that one as yet um same with there was a pendant i was looking at it's a crimson pendant but that needs uh guy spirits as well i believe a guy spirit. Um, but we want to make this one. So basically, the pyroclast pendant will put us out if we're on fire. But the other one, the upgraded one, will make it so, um, you know, we can essentially swim in lava. Um, so have I got any string? I have some string somewhere, when I? What was it? Pyro. Uh, yes, yeah, so we just need to put some string in there. That's fine. One of these. Summer and fire. Hopefully we got a summer and a fire one left. Definitely got the fire. Summer. Oh, no. All right, what summer? Watermelon, slime balls, and... Uh, earth and air. That's easy enough. Hmm. Earth and air. Uh, one of these. Did I take it? I did, didn't I? What did I say needed? I wasn't paying attention. Uh, two sands. Watermelon and slime ball. Ah. Watermelon. And slime ball. Do we have any slime? In here. Can we use the Tinker's one? A congealed slime block. It's essentially a slime block, right? Yeah. Good. We can we can use that. That's absolutely fine. Um, we're gonna put a stairway sort of in here in a second. Let me just sort out this. Uh, that, well, this is these aren't even going on. I do want to automate that as well if I can. Where'd it go? There it is. Um, might just end up waiting for the um, what's it called? The ME system. You ready to go? We are. So pendant is fire straight. That was it. We need strength, didn't we? Over it. Oh, we missed it. And too high. <laughs> oh, we can. We're still using this, even though we can fly. This is the wrong side. This is the wrong side. String, please. That's this little system down there. Loud. <laughs> uh, one, two, three, four. Get back in there. Oh, this is empty. So uh, turn this off and let it recharge. Throw that in here. That's working its magic. That should be doing fine. Class pendant. Boom. Now, where does it go? Can we just shift it in? Right at the top there. Excellent. So now we're. Like, we've got a lot of bubbles filled. <laughs> a lot of bubbles filled. Can we see where it is on us? Let's just run our neck look. Yes. <laughs> look how uh, middle aged I look. It's funny. Anyway, I'm going to get to work on this um, stairway, and we're going to put some stairways throughout the building as well. 
So we're going to go from the top floor here, or sorry, the middle, this middle, second, whatever floor it is, down to here. Uh, probably on both sides, and then there's going to be a floor going down from here to here. There's gonna also going to be a, a stairway that goes down through there. And, oh, I'm on the windmill. Which will come out round right about here, somewhere, maybe. And then we'll have a stairway down from these flowers. It's going to go into like a little balcony. And then that's going to go straight across in front of this waterfall. And then sort of wind down the bottom there. What is this? What is this? Ah, someone's fishing. Respiration free. Who's this? Sweep ah, I bought, made that book earlier. Typical. Made enough cards inside. Shimmer. Makes it shimmer as if it was enchanted. That's all, really. Nothing more. Yes, it's useless. I know. Oh, I could use that. <laughs> Bane, flame, not back, fire. See, that's not, they're not too bad, but they're only level freeze. Who belongs? Who's this? Swarf? Is this yours? Not too sure. Um, yep, so I'm going to um, sort my life out and hopefully show you the finished product. Um, I don't really build on camera uh, that much because it's going to take a lot of trial and error, especially with like levels and stuff. Um, but we'll try and make it look pretty and we'll we'll end it on a on a nice looking note. At least at least I hope so. I've built an escape route for you, Richie. Why don't you leave? Is it Stockholm Syndrome? <laughs> uh, I think he's interested in these flowers because uh, much like torches, they like to break them. Which is uh, horrible. But I've got a golden lasso on me, so you're coming whether you like it or not. But just catch him. Hey! Wait. Did I, no? There he is. There he is. So I haven't done a bit to the outside as yet. Uh, but I've done a staircase on this side here. Uh, leaves us a bit of space to get underneath there. And goes up nicely to this floor in the centre. Got some balustrades to make it look quite fancy. As you can see there, we've got the, the stairway up to the next, uh, next stairs. Next stairs doesn't work. Be free. Enjoy. Etc. You're perplexed. Have a look around. Um, so I got uh, an idea to put some stuff in here, but we're probably going to get that to that uh, next episode or the one after. Not sure yet. Essentially, it's going to be the runes. And on this side will be most of the stuff from up there. So I'm going to mirror this both sides. Uh, so there'll be a staircase going down there and one up that side. And there was one more. And we're not going to take it because, you know, we can fly now. <laughs> that comes upstairs here to balustrade stuff. This is all going to get moved as well. Uh, Toying to have the Emmy system either this side or this side. I'm not sure at the moment. I kind of want wherever it goes that there's we still use these drawers. Just so we can got you can get the block, nugget, and ingot version of both things. But here we are, we've made a little bit of a, a cut into this little room here. It's gonna be the same on the other side there. And it's just a simple case of stairs going up to this little balcony thing. Cool, cool. So yeah, I'm gonna mirror it on both sides because I I like symmetry. I'm that kind of guy. <laughs> um, but there was one thing that I wanted to do, but I need some stuff. Do we need is it this? Is this five and six. Can't remember. Uh, what are you? Uh, we're gonna make a not a piston. I don't know what that's written there for. The bifrost. Wand of the bifrost. Rod of the Bifrost, even. Uh, two of these, two of them, and one of them. Uh, and this is going to be some fancy stuff. Or f some fancy looking stuff, at least. Um, so the one, the Bifrost, if we just shift click it in. Like this, we've got too much of that. That's fine. Uh, what this does is, if we activate it, we fall straight through. Wait a minute, what? <laughs> That's not what's meant to happen. Oh, there's a cooldown. It's a cooldown, you see. Um, what it does is it makes a fancy bridge from one place to another. Uh, that's more than three blocks long, usually. Um, so we're going to have that, I think, on this floor. Going out this way. Um, so if we were to do it here, for instance. Do we have to... Come the block. 
Is that it behind me for some reason? Why you do this? Um, I don't think I'm doing it correctly, but um, hey ho, it's all learning curve, right? What we want is a uh, having a can I type. There we are. Where are you? I still can't see you. There you are. That's why you're hidden. One of these. Now. The living wood, what's it called? It avatar. That's not right. Oh, I killed myself. <laughs> I give myself withering. Idiot. It's all good. We got plenty of hearts, so it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> uh, anyway, living wood avatar. I want to put it. I can remember. I think is it gonna be there or there? Let's say there. Hey. <laughs> uh, now these can hold. Ones. Is he holding it? I can't actually see if he's holding it or not. Now, will you be getting mana from there? I should have planned this through before um, recording this, shouldn't I? Oh, don't tell me it just misses by one block. That'd be horrible. Come on. Anyway. What he should be doing, I've been walking in front of him. you actually going to be out of mana. Are you kidding me? No, the whole, the whole premise of this, uh, this thing is ruined. Give me the things, right? If you were a block lower, then I'm just gonna have to move. I'm gonna have to put a little stairway or something here. That's that's fine. It's snowing, of course it is. And I'm losing all my blocks. I don't care anymore. <laughs> Are you getting stuffs now? You are. I'm sure we can feed you from the bottom. Why aren't you doing things? Do you not have enough? Hello. Excuse me. Pardon me. What's meant to happen <laughs> is this guy is meant to uh, make a pathway for us. This has got stuff in it, right? It has. Do I have to... Maybe I have to focus... Yeah, it's going straight through him. Actually, does that mean? Does that mean? Hold on, we might have we might have saved it yet. We might have saved it yet. Um, sorry, little buddy. I'm just gonna give you a chop. That's my bifrost. There we are. Um, yeah, I think that that um that little dot was an indicator that um of the efficiency of the fox. We call it. There we are. So now, if we're still linked to the thing below, can we? Make it to you. Do you have stuff now? Will you be our friend? No? <laughs> no. Well, <laughs> that's a shame. That is, is it because there's a box underneath or did I just place it there? Who knows? Is it because it's out of range? That would be a shame if it was. Right. Last try. <laughs> Last try. There's sufficient mana in there, right? Otherwise, you're a little bit useless, aren't you, mate? We'll sort it out. We'll, we get, we'll get there. We'll get there. Are you? Connect. With you. No, this is just no. Well, I'm going to have to work on this off camera. Uh, but what you should be doing is making a pathway. Why won't you make a pathway? It's going into you, right? Do you not have sufficient... Do you distort some mana first? Try again. <laughs> no. I will have to uh, sort it out off camera. It's not working. Anyway, um, so what we can do with the Wonder Bifrost is we can make some fancy looking blocks of it. And I've got a freeze frame. Hello? There we are. We can do that with... Uh, too far. Is it with these ones? Let's just do a stack. That's more than a stack. There we are. If we put that in there and that in there, it doesn't work. Is it with the Dreamwood?
Hmm. Is this Bifrost working at all? Do it with Elf Bass. What's it called? Shimmering? Shimmerwood? It's just Dreamwood and the glass. So we have to. Okay, we have to do the glass first. We've got any elf glass? We have got some elf glass in here somewhere. You? No. Up here, please. There it is. <laughs> so, let's start that again. Elf glass is quite fancy looking glass like this. Why, why is he twitching in my hand? Why are you twitching there? Uh, it emits light and it changes to all the fancy colours. And we can combine that with... <sighs> Different wood? That it literally just showed me. Bifrost frost block. Planks. Planks, planks, planks. That's <laughs> You know what? I don't even want to build of these anymore. Rubbish. Terrible looking. <laughs> Why are you no know... Am I being a foolish? My frost block. Is that right? I haven't even converted it yet. I'm using the wrong ones. Fools. There we are. Shimmerwood planks. And these are the same sort of thing. They're lovely looking planks that change through all the colours of the rainbow. Uh, so we'll probably use this to decorate it because it does actually look quite cool. Uh, it just took me a while to um, you know, sort it out because I'm an idiot. Uh, but that is going to be it for this episode. Thank you all very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed and we'll see you next time. Goodbye everybody.